So there was a presidential debate Thursday night. It was the Trump versus Biden debate. The first one out of the two that are planned. And it was a disaster for the Democrats. They're now doing damage control, trying to get Biden out of the way. And he may not be the Democrat nominee anymore because of his performance in this debate. There are many quips that are circulating on this debate, from this debate. Because he performed, well, terribly, and there's a lot of highlights. And I watched this whole debate through, and I've picked out what I think is the most embarrassing moment for Biden in the debate that I haven't really seen touched. Uh, obviously, there's some more, you know, circulated clips, but this one isn't really circulated as much and i think that it should be because it perfectly encapsulates what he did the entire time was avoid questions and when he tried to answer questions he'd like ramble on about nothing for a little bit and bring things up that had nothing to do with the question and then he would answer it afterwards with an incoherent answer and this was a perfect example he was being asked about abortion and Roe v. Wade. And this this is pretty much his response. Look, there's so many young women who have been, including a young woman who just was murdered. And he, he went to the funeral. Uh, the idea that she was murdered by, a, by, a, by an immigrant coming in. To, they talk about that. But here's the deal. There's a lot of young women who are being raped by their, by their in-laws, by their, by, by their spouses brothers and sisters by oh, just it's, it's just ridiculous and they can do nothing about it and they try to arrest them when they cross state lines thank you you can tell that the moderator does not want him to speak anymore because he made several blunders first of all he brings up immigration when the topic was not immigration they hadn't gotten to that point yet secondly he says that a woman needs to seek abortion because she gets raped by her spouse's brothers or sisters. Now, the thing that gets me is sisters. Now, I understand that there are radicals in his party and on his side of the aisle that want to deconstruct the concept of being a woman to basically make it meaningless and basically say, well, you are a woman if you say you are one. But that's not the world that we live in. The reality we live in is that there are biological differences between male and females and by extension between men and women. And women cannot get each other pregnant. It just does not work that way. So if on the off chance that a woman gets raped by her sister, which God forbid that ever happened, I do not wish that ever to happen. That's disgusting. But even if that were to happen, that would not be cause for an abortion that has no bearing on it because there's won't be a pregnancy there now of course he can't say that because he panders to people who don't believe in the men and women distinction but you know real life doesn't actually agree with with what he's talking about here and i'm sure this was just like a technical blunder but he did so much of the of that in this debate, and it was ridiculous. There's so much to go through. If you want to go and watch this through yourself, I watched this entire debate. If you want an hour and a half comedy show, you can go watch it. There, there's so many moments where he just talks about weird, unrelated stuff. He was being asked about like some something or other, and talking about COVID and Medicare, and that's just not at all it was it was topical and. Listen, there was just so many moments that you could go watch for yourself, but this one I think is the is the most embarrassing one because it perfectly encapsulates everything. I mean, he even sounded like he had no idea what he was talking about. He was fumbling his words, which was very common throughout this entire debate. There was people trying to do apologetics for him being like, oh, he had a, st a slow start but a strong finish. No, he didn't have a strong finish either. His closing statement was terrible. Now, of course, there's a lot to analyze with this debate. There's some critiques of Trump that I have, but I'll save that for another video. This is, I just think this is the most embarrassing moment for Biden. Not a good look. 
This entire debate was not a good look, but this in particular, talking about sisters raping their sisters and causing needs for abortion and stuff, well, that's just makes no sense but you know that's just my opinion maybe you think there was there was worse clips or certainly more viral clips of the whole debate let me know what you guys think and if you guys like this video and like this content make sure to leave a like and subscribe and if you want me to analyze more on this debate have more things you want me to add let me know and i'll see you guys in the next one god bless